Hey you guys, it's me Bossy and I know I haven't uploaded a video in a couple of weeks and I will let you guys know why in a few. Um, but first I do want to say hello to all my old subscribers as well as my new subscribers that I have recently gotten here on my channel. I really hope you guys are enjoying the content that I have on my channel and thanks again for subscribing. I basically want to let you guys know why I have not posted a video in about almost three weeks because I have been posting them weekly, sometimes twice a week. Um, some of you that follow me on Instagram uh, may have seen um, my post I did about my mother. Um, my mother um, recently passed. She passed on June Six, um, at the age of 58 she had been battling lupus for a little over 10 years and she finally lost her battle to the lupus but I'm doing a little better it helps to know that she's no longer in pain anymore that's the baby and I know she's in a better place so that's why I have been absent, you guys. Um, so yeah, now to get on to the video. Um, this video is going to be my first Mac haul. Um, I mean, to some it might not be much. Um, but I mean, I have a few things that I want to share that I've recently picked up over the last couple of weeks okay you guys so the first thing that i'm going to show you um is the fix plus now this is the little ten dollar bottle i wanted to try out the smaller size for 10 bucks before i jumped out there and got the actual full size bottle i just wanted to see how this works as far as when i set my makeup um so i have not yet used this so I'm excited to try it and see what the hype is about. The next thing that I uh, purchased from MAC. So I wanted to try the MAC Face and Body Foundation. Um, and I got mine in the color C6 is the color of this foundation. And I'm going to open it. This is the one I got and this is in C6. I don't see like any other name for it. It just says face. It just says face and body. So I can't wait to use this. I have seen it on my face when I got it put on in Mac. So it matched and it wasn't heavy. It was felt lightweight, and that's what I like. So we're gonna see how this works. If you guys want to see a demo of me using this, let me know in the comments below. Okay, next you guys, I'm going to show you two concealers that I picked up as well. The first one I'm gonna show you is the MAC Pro Long Wear Concealer. And this is in the color NC42. And I haven't tried this yet, but it comes in this little bottle like this. Oh, and it has a little pump. So yeah, I can use this for an under eye highlight. So we'll see how this works. And I'm hoping it doesn't crease up on me because like my LA Girl Pro Concealers, sometimes I notice they do tend to crease slightly. So I'm gonna see if MAC, with it being more expensive, if it will do the same or if it will not crease. The next concealer I got was the Mineralize Concealer in NC42. And this one looks just like this. And it comes with a brush. Hmm. I should swatch it on my hand to see how light it is. Oh yeah, so I can use this as an under eye highlight as well. So these are both of the concealers I got. I got the Mineralize Concealer 
in NC42 and the Pro Long Wear Concealer in NC42 as well. Okay, you guys, so next I'm going to show you some MAC Mineralized Skin Finishes. Now, the first one I'm going to show you is Global Glow. Comes in this box. I like the effect of the box. And from seeing like other people's videos and MAC hauls, it seems as though MAC has changed their packaging on their mineralized skin finishes. So this is in Global Glow. Okay, you guys, I had to fix my lighting so you could see the swatch, the swatches. But this is Global Glow. And it's a mineralized skin finish. I thought this was really pretty. This will be a beautiful highlight. Look at that. Oh, yes, that's a beautiful highlight. Okay, this next mineralized skin finish um, I got actually from the Osborne collection that came out about two weeks ago. Um, I'm just now sharing it with you, and I still haven't used it, but um, I got the mineralized skin finish. And this is the Kelly Boxing. And it comes in this really cute packaging with her signature on it. And this mineralized skin finish is called Jolly Good. And this is what it looks like. And you guys, I haven't tried this yet on, so I don't know if it will match, but I'm going to do some quick swatches of it. You see that? Just set your face, your whole face with this, really. And then I'm going to try the other. This is the lighter color that I'm hoping I can use as a highlighter. And I think I may be able to, guys. Sorry if my swatches suck. So yeah, this is in Jolly Good and this is the Kelly Osborne Mineralized Skin Finish. Okay, you guys, now on to the lipsticks. Now, two of these lipsticks I actually have been wearing because you know I picked up some of these items about two weeks ago um and so yeah two of these lipsticks I have already been wearing and I love them to death and then the other two I have not worn yet um so I'm gonna show you the first one I got and this one I have been loving for summer and this one is in Lady Danger oh and this is like a gorgeous color it's a red but it has like it, it's more of a red orange. Let me swatch it. And this is a matte finish. So this is a really nice color for the summer and spring. Okay, you guys, this next one, as you know, I like purple everything. And so this color I have been wanting, um... And I mean, I finally decided to go get it. So it is Max Heroin, and this is also a matte lipstick. And I wore this days and days in a row, and I have only had it for like two weeks, as you can see. And this is Max Heroin, and let me do a swatch. Oh, look at that color. I love it heroin i finally got it y'all and i've been rocking the hell out of some heroin and guys sorry if my lighting keeps changing it looks like it's not right to me um but this next lipstick is also from the osborne collection and this is a matte lipstick and this is from the kelly line and this is riot house comes in this cute lavender packaging still in the standard bullet shape for mac lipsticks And this is Riot House. It is more of a peachy orange 
color and I haven't worn this yet but let me swatch it for you guys there it is right there it's a matte but it's not as matte as the other two in my opinion so again so again this is what it looks like and I know for a fact that I'm going to have to wear this one with a liner because I do not want to be looking all kinds of crazy. But I thought it was a really pretty color. Um, and yeah. Okay, you guys. And before I show you this last lipstick. Now, I haven't been a just long time shopper of MAC Cosmetics. So I don't know if this happens a lot. But MAC had been just throwing out new collection after new collection after new collection this summer. And so right after I got the couple items that I got from the um, Osborne collection, Lord, Lord, I guess that's her name. You know, we will never be royals, whatever. She came out with pure heroin. And of course I have heroin. So I said, why not get pure heroin? So this is pure heroin. And I'm going to do the swatch right next to the original heroin. And this one is actually a amplified finish. So this one is the only one that I recently got that was not matte. But this is what that looks like. And I'm going to swatch it right next to heroin. This is pure heroin here, and then this is the original heroin here. So heroin here, it still to me is a tad bit lighter, and of course it is a matte, which is my favorite type of lipstick. And this is an amplified finish, so this one um, is not matte, and it's more, to me, a deeper, darker purple color. So, yeah, you guys, these are all the items that I have um, recently gotten from MAC over the past couple of weeks. I hope you enjoyed this video. It wasn't a ton of things, and I'm going to keep it real. MAC is not cheap, y'all. So, yeah, I was going to get what was in my means and not just going to try to buy everything just because it's MAC. Okay. So, yeah, I want to again say thank what's up to all my new subscribers and to all my old loyal subscribers i really appreciate you guys so much and i haven't forgotten i need to be doing another giveaway because i did get over 500 subscribers so i haven't forgotten i'm just trying to think of some good <laughs> prizes to give away in my giveaway so yeah you guys i will see you in the next video until next time bye loves